Good morning and welcome to Gaya Bonsai here in South West Cornwall. Uh, today's another catch up video and this is a catch up with the Japanese black pines. Three years old now growing from seed and as you can see there's quite a considerable difference in the uh, vigour of them. This is probably the uh, largest one which I'm guessing must be getting on for 18 inches tall. Now I'm not sure exactly what's happening here because the candles are starting to uh, expand but I'm not sure if they're going to expand fully or go semi-dormant as we're getting on to uh, quite late in the year for the growing season anyway. I'll keep an eye on it. Uh, I haven't pinched any out yet because this is one I've got in a that's in a three litre pot so that's growing quite vigorously. It's got a quite a nice thick trunk with some lovely roots on it as well. It's budding back quite well. So basically on the pines all I've done is um, as you can see from the previous videos is I pinched the candles out uh, for the branch structure and also removed about a third of the old needles and as you can see there's bud back coming on the trunk from the little dormant buds there. So that's the biggest one so that's grown really well. They've all had the same amount of um, care, water, been fertilised the same. The only thing I've done differently is when the roots have filled the pot is I've repotted them on. So that's another one. This is in a one litre pot. That's got some nice little bud backs. Trunk's starting to grow nicely. It's got a couple of nice branches here and the candles are starting to swell on this one as well. So it'll be interesting to see. <laughs> <laughs> what happened really? I think everything's got a bit confused with this uh, strange weather we have. It's so cold and then it's hot, then we've got storms and rain. Anyway, that's the two garden trees. Um, and now I have a look at the uh, two I've got in the seed trays that I'm training to hopefully be potential uh, bonsais. One is uh, pinch the uh, candles out. And I don't know if you can see in there it's just starting to bud back from some of the dormant buds on the trunk so that will give some uh, new branches hopefully this one's about a foot tall that's the new growth there which has got looks like that one set dormant buds at the moment uh, the needles are still quite long there's a couple of dormant I think there's two three dormant buds there for potential new branches so I've done the same pinch the buds out as they were growing and just pluck some of the needles and it's got quite a few little branches coming here so what I'll do is just nip these out as we've got There's another one in there. I'll just nip those out and probably that one under it. So I've got another branch there. I'll try not to get too many branches coming from the same place. Otherwise it's starting to make the, uh, the uh, unsightly bulge in the trunk. So this one, I'll just top the soil level up, I think. Uh, give it a feed with some tomato right fertilizer. And then come next spring, I'll pot it into one of the uh, bonsai pots that I showed you with the uh, with the larch video. This is the second Japanese black pine. That's uh, three years old, growing from seed. So this has had the same as uh, all the others. Uh, the candles um, pinched out. As you can see, there's quite a nice lot of back budding here on the trunk, another section in here and this little beginnings of a nice little branch. You can see how much bud back is is coming from pinching the new tips out so that's looking very encouraging. The trunk is a little bit ugly here but there's another little one coming out there. I'll leave that to Fatten it up. 
And it's got a nice curve. I'm not sure how flexible the trunks are. Oh, they're fairly flexible. So in the spring, when I repot this into a bonsai training pot, what I'll do is put a bit more of a bend in the trunk and see how it responds to that. But that's the uh, second potential black pine bonsai. So that's that's quite a nice shaped tree and I quite like how all this is um, how all this is grown with all the bud backing on the branch so it just goes to show what's possible for that so that's uh, a quick cover up uh, cover so that's a quick cover of all the black pines I'll uh, top the saw level up on this one and then um, give it a few bits and tomato right so thank you very much for watching take care and i look forward to making some more videos for you very shortly bye bye for now